When I interview leaders that are managing transitions, too many times the leaders have really never described a compelling vision of the future. I know, and, and I'm not just the V word. Describe the future with such particularity that I can feel it and touch it and want to be there. How many times do we just look at an org chart and manage a transition? If you want to connect with me emotionally, give me an emotional reason to connect. People aren't all curing cancer. It's not like every day we're going to reshape education in America. But I've seen leaders who are writing teams that are writing software that come to work just as enthused because they are the best in the world at what they do. When people believe they're the best in the world at what they do, they want to play. The best want to play with the best. I don't think there's any other way around that. And I think that when we look at this, it's, it's pretty thing. They want to feel safe. Pretty tough when we have a lot of reorganization, but people need to feel psychologically safe. They have to believe the environment's fair. They want to connect with other people they care deeply about. They have to have an opportunity to grow and find meaning in their jobs. When leaders can say, it's fair, it's safe, I love the people I'm around, I have an opportunity to learn and grow, and this job provides meaning in life that makes it worthwhile doing, I think they've got a real, a real shot at doing it.